So it's very common in our line of work for us to come against people within the hierarchy that are not bought into the vision. Not uncommon for this level to have the vision and somebody in between the shop floor is not quite caught that vision. You've got somebody at the top that's saying, we're gonna do this. And you've got the rest of the organization that is like, eh, not so sure. When we go into an opportunity like that, normally it is the people that have been there for 20 or 30 years, they've seen it happen, been there, done that, that you've got to connect with. You've got to find some way to connect with them in order to win them over. And it's usually not immediate. You know, it's usually a mix of getting them involved with others, some people with fresh eyes, um, some people that have caught the vision and helping them see that we can make a difference, that we can have an impact. Yeah, it's not uncommon that you've got to walk people through that process and you've got to use creative approaches in order to win them over. Most of the time it's when I see some results, then I'll get on board. And so, you know, you may have to have a particular relationship that is sitting on the sidelines initially in order to see that we can make a difference and then you find a way to work it in. A lot of times there's other ways you can connect with those people. Any of those people are experiencing some kind of pain. It's very uncommon for us to go in and find people that are just happy with the way things are going. Everybody has some kind of pain. And if you can identify what that pain is and what that frustration is, then you have the opportunity to be able to help them overcome something. And it could be, it could be I just don't get the information that I need on a regular basis. I never find out until the last minute. Well, what if we could put a process in place that could fix that? I can help with that.